Second Baptist Church has been my church since I was about seven or eight years old. I was saved when I was nine years old. Bax Aubridge was here at that time, and then there were two or three other pastors. And then when Brother Paul Graham came in, then he was here for 40-some years till Brother Ken Newport came in in 2001. So the last two have been here. You know, longevity has been very good. Well, I grew up as a teenager with Charlene Frost, and her husband was part of the youth teachers when I was growing up. I was married in Second Baptist Church. We weren't here. We were down farther east on Grand where uh, Bridgeway is, the little white building there. That was the front part of the church there and that's where I was married. As a young wife, I was gone about 17 years. We went around the world as military family, came back to Ponca City in 1979 and I have been here ever since. So it's just, it's just my home. When I was in the military, I was in churches but you weren't any place long enough to really get good contact with people. You know, they're two or three years and then you're gone. So it, it's nice to, to grow up with pastors. I think one of the things I really like is our church family. That's what I think of it is, is my family at church because uh, I think we're a congregation that love each other. I think we're a congregation that want to be there to help each other and as well as sharing the word of the Lord, but to help in times of need, to help in times of joy. I just really enjoy my family and there have been some highs and lows in my my family and in my lifetime and I've always had somebody there. I've had my family to take care of me but then I've also had people in my church that have loved on me and, and wanted to help and I know we do that and that to me is very special. That's one of the things I love about our church is that we we do love each other. We love the Lord but we love each other and we want to take care of each other as much as we can. I know that I have a pastor that when he preaches the word, whether it's Sunday, whether it's Wednesday, he preaches the truth and he preaches what God wants us to hear. I am so thankful that I don't have to worry about whether I'm going to be led astray by what's coming from the pulpit. So I love my pastor and I love the fact that he directs us and guides us. And I know that what we're hearing is truth. And then another thing that I love about our church is our mission work. I just think it's so exciting to have a, a church that has a vision for ch missions that what we send out may seem minor to some people but it's important to us and I just am excited about the fact that we get to share spreading the word around the world and I that excites me about my church.